This teapot is so much bigger on the inside. I can't believe it. Thank you for inviting me. It's always nice to broaden one's horizons. Okay. Due to confidentiality restrictions, I can't share any specific case details with you. But I can tell you a story about the Special Security and Surveillance Patrol. Some time ago, we lost one of the members of our platoon. He sacrificed himself while carrying out an important mission. We arranged a funeral service for him and turned his effects over to his family. The only thing we held on to was the cap from his uniform. It's a tradition. If his son decided to join the guards in the future, we would pass the cap down to him. One day, after everything was settled, I saw a group of people gathered outside. I rushed over, thinking there was someone causing a disturbance. It was. The boy grabbed one of my guards by the sleeve and asked, Have you seen my daddy? He couldn't describe his father's appearance beyond the fact that he was big and tall. The boy just kept repeating his father's name over and over again, but there was little we could say in return. We all knew that his father had long been part of covert operations for the Special Patrol, and hadn't been able to return home after the birth of his son. But there was something we didn't know. In order to protect his cover, he hadn't left behind a single picture of himself, even for his family. The boy had learned from his mother that his father was an honored guard of the Special Security and Surveillance Patrol. But I would imagine the word honor meant very little to him, and that it was even harder to comprehend that his father was never coming back. In the end, we escorted the boy home, and each member of my platoon left him with a gift. Some gave him a pocket watch, a pen, or a badge. I gave him a copy of my favorite novel. I hope that he can be like the hero in that novel one day and have the resolve to follow his own path, whether he makes the choice to don his father's cap or follow a path that leads him away from the guards. My only wish is that he feels proud of his father all the same. <laughs>